what I'm about to show you is a microphone made for your iPhone and your iPad. It captures good audio within a long range. Stay tuned to learn more about the Lewina Wireless Lavilla microphone for the iPhone and iPad. Hello YouTube, how are you doing? I'm Dara and I'm back with another mobile recording gadget just for you. But before we say anything else, let's go check out what comes in the box. Let's get the box open right now. Just look around the side of the box and see what it comes with and all the details right there. It looks really beautiful. So right now let's go open it up. Well, I gotta use a knife to rip that open. And then I gently lift that. See, it's even magnetic. The packaging from Leona is really on point, I must say. And it's just got a very light kind of film above to protect the microphone. And then right there in that box, is the USB C charging cable. That's for the pod that comes with the microphone system. So it's a dual charging kind of system. There's nothing further there. So let's go ahead and bring the microphone box out right now. It's really stored in the box. I think that's part of the packaging agenda from Lawina to actually make things look really premium, which I think I really like. Of course, below there you can see the user manual. But let's rip the nylon protection also around it open. And there is the box that contains the microphone. So the USB-C just plugs in there. You can plug it to any USB port you got. And then in there, that is the receiver you plug into your iPhone or iPad. And then that is the microphone that you clip on to your cloth, which charges, of course, from inside the box also by itself. And then finally, in the box, we have the user manual that contains instructions on how you can use the microphone system. So let's go put that away right now. Just showing you that box again. Looks really nice. I will be keeping that box definitely. And that's the casing right there. That I just put stuff back in. And then it just clips on starts charging well of course you have to remember to remove the nylon protection at the base of the microphone transmitter so it starts charging once you plug it in or put it in so that this is the charging i'm going to be using a power bank for the purpose of this i can see it has a red indicator at the front of it that shows it's charging of the case which also charges the microphone transmitter all the audio for this video was recorded with this microphone right here with no special effects noise removal or eq whatsoever let's go feel what the raw audio and you know all the plosive test sounds like peter piper placed a plate beside a dog at the pillar to pet a dog in poland what does that sound like and we'll go ahead and actually see what the audio sounds like how does so let's go check that out let's get out for a moment hello this is testing the Lorena wireless lavalier microphone system do you like the audio you're hearing from it? I can walk around the park and you can see it captures the audio just around me. I can move here, turn around, and it still captures from a great wide of length. So I'm about uh, 30 feet away, 40, 50 feet, and 60 feet away, just moving back. And I can walk back and the audio quality, hopefully, should not be lost along the way. I hope you like the sound you're hearing from me. There's wind all around me, but of course, I hope it comes out really well. I am in a university campus today, and I'm just walking around trying to sample the audio experience all around. It's not that noisy this morning, but there's wind all around me, as you can probably imagine. And well, there's a bus moving around, and I hope it doesn't uh, get the noise around it. I hope you like the sound and the feel you're hearing from this. I can hear the bus. I hope you cannot. And then I can just uh, move around, turn my back, and turn around, and move far away, just away, and back, and back, and back, and very much back. 
move further back and further back and further back and further back. I think that's enough fit between me and the receiver of the microphone and I can walk back just to it and get the audio feel out of it. I hope you like the sound and feel of it. Thank you. And we're back. Now, let's talk about the tech, the specs and compatibility of this Lewina wireless Lavilla microphone for the iPhone and iPad. Well, of course, it's plug and play for your iPhone and your iPad. That means that you don't need to install any special app on the iPhone or iPad. You just hook it up and it starts working. You can record this to your memo app or just hook it up to your camera to record your videos for your TikToks, for your YouTube shots, for your Instagram live. And you just plug it in and then just get started with it. The only thing that is a caveat with, a, with this microphone is that you need to remove it before you are able to listen back to whatever you've recorded. And also, it's got just a lightning cable with it, so it's not USB-C compatible. But of course, that is not a blocker because it was made specifically for the iPhone. So it's compatible with the iPhone 7 upwards and iPads 2, 3, and 4. So any USB-C iDevices, iPhone, iPad, or whatever may come in the future, this microphone would not be compatible with it. But of course, if you want to check out the USB-C version of the Leona Wireless Lavalier microphone, you can check this link above here or somewhere in the description below to check that out. Now, let's talk about the recording quality of this microphone. It records CD quality, that's 48 kilohertz audio. It has a range of about 120 meters. That is uh, without a barrier between you and where you can record. As you can see in the outdoor test that we did, I was very far away from the uh, iPhone recording that. And I used just this microphone to record that. And of course, with some noise on the run, but of course, it's still bearable for outdoor scenarios. But right now, I'm inside the house and you can see the difference between the audio that I got going on. So this microphone right here can run for about four to six hours on a single charge which is just about two hours so uh today i put it in my bag after charging it up via the usb cable that comes with it and then i was on the road and i haven't charged it since then one sweet thing is this case also serves as the charging port for the microphone system so if you look here uh it's got a connector somewhere inside here that it charges from who should get this microphone system i would recommend this microphone for someone with an iphone or an ipad looking to record crisp noiseless audio with your phone and publish to online sources or just want to go live with this kind of scenarios so if you happen to record podcasts on your phone also you know i'm a big fan of mobility of recording your podcast on your phones and tablets and stuff this microphone is also for you it's really good it is good enough to capture good audio, especially if you're recording interviews and shows and you're always on the move you don't want to carry lots of gears this fits in just right for you because it's just light where you can hook it up to your pocket boom and then off you go and then once you're done eject put it in the case and start charging and you're good to go well that is my review of the Lewina wireless lavalier microphone i hope you liked it if you did you know what to do now give it a thumbs up and also if you're new to my channel and you have not subscribed yet please go ahead and subscribe i need a notification bell so you do not miss any upcoming videos just like this from me and also help others discover videos just like this. What do you think about the Lewina Wireless Lav Mic for iPhone and iPad? Let me know in the comment section and I'll be waiting to hear from you. Till I come your way again with another video, unboxing tech, reviews, live streams, music and whatsoever. You know what I say. Stay safe and goodbye.